Hey everyone, it's Tiffany from Let's Get Scrappy and I have a quick project to share with you guys. This is not my tutorial, um, but it's so stinking cute. I just wanted to share it with you. Um, this is my first official project of 2024. Um, and it is made from uh, this collection. I had got the bigger collection kit for Christmas, but it's Echo Park. Love Notes from Country Craft Creations. So I'll have that link below. Um, I also used, as you can see, um, the brand new um, Artisan Glamour Glitter. I don't know if this is called Artisan. But it's um, the Glamour Glitter Paper in Ruby Red. They are out of stock right now, but um, the glitter should be restocked full force. It went so fast. Um, but it should be restocked um, within, I think, like the next week. So stay tuned. Again, if you want me to let you know when it is restocked, just put a comment below and I'll let you know that. But just a quick tiff tip, if you anywhere, like if you're using papers from places, so like for me, this is from Country Craft Creations, with your scraps, create your own um, little swatch and just put them all together. So then I'll know if I use the rest of this one sheet, which it comes 12 by 12. If I use the rest, I'll have this to use as a swatch to know that this is a color I want to order. I know what the color looks like because I promise you the colors look different online and that's everywhere always does. Um, but I made this. I can't wait to show you guys. So this is Kim's from Kim Can't Stop Crafting and I'll have her channel link below. I think I said that right. Um, we did the Country Craft Creations New Year's Eve crop and all the designers had amazing projects. It was a pajama party slash game night type of thing and um I uh, did hers which is um it's a box that holds two deck of cards and then you lift it up on an easel and you could put your cards like your hand in there so nobody can see them which is adorable and I was about to do it I was gonna do it with the collection I'm looking at it right now what is it called family family night but then the collection was weird like I, I don't know I thought it was <laughs> It had more like movie watch. I wanted like actual cards, you know, whatever. But then I was like, wait, I'm never going to use this myself, but I'll use it if I do it as Valentine's. So wait till you see. So um, I just did a cluster up here. These tags are from the actual collection. Some flowers from my stash, ribbon from my stash. I use the red, ruby red glitter paper just on um, the outside, I might have used some on the inside in a, in a spot. I can't remember. I kept going back and forth. And then these are from the sticker sheets. Just layered those up. The ephemera. So stinking cute. Okay, and then, I'm because you guys know I always show you my boo-boos, even though it still works out no matter what. But I added this lip on there um, just because I wanted a lip. But my magnet isn't closing it very well, so it's kind of loose. So as you can see... It's just not as tight as I'd want it to be. Um, and I don't know if it's just because I have to, such a thin spot for the magnet. I don't know. But I wanted it tighter. But otherwise, like she does a ribbon tie closure, which you could with this and it would still be cute. So this is um, the back. I used that ruby red glitter paper here. And this is the no shed. It does not shed. Oh, I just love, love, love. So, um... Uh, the sides look like that. I'll show you guys in a second. But, okay, so the top still does the easel. I wanted it still to pop up. You guys can't really see that. So it still pops up. So cute. Um, so I have, this is ephemera. Yeah, ephemera, some stickers on it. I finished the inside just because I like to. And you could do this as still a pocket and slide a gift card in there or a sentiment. It doesn't have to be with this. I had just already put my paper down and my magnet was here. I was like, ah, eh, I don't want to keep adding to it. So, and I did finish the underside right there as well, just so you guys can see. And of course your girl had to mat it because I have problems. So projects that take everyone else an hour takes me 20. I don't know makes no sense to me but I just thought this would be cute to, you know pop up even as decor um it's just you know it's just fun okay so and I do have like I said I have a magnet in here because I like it and I put a magnet back here because 
I didn't like um, it flopping. And it's still, once I put paper on, I don't know, these magnets, they're not working so well through all the layers of paper. And I only have it on, do I have it under? I'm trying to look. Oh, no. Yeah. Usually, I put my mat down first, and then I do my decorative paper. And on the back, for some reason, I think I was either talking to somebody or watching a show, and I wasn't paying attention. But it still, it still works. But, oh, and then, tip, tip. Don't put these so high because you got to fold this over. <laughs> so I have to fold mine because as you guys can see, it bumps. So I got to fold it under. <gasps> but look what I did. So and I'm going to show you. You can do the Kit Kats. You can do the Cutie Pies. Um, like the little, you know, candy hearts. Let me fold it open like that. So here's where you would put the two deck of cards. She glued hers down. But I don't, I like it where I can lift this up and the things come out. Boop. Boop. And then I have still the underneath done. But you, you guys can have so much fun with this. You can make two pockets here. Again, these could be gift cards underneath the candy that they have to get to. Um, like I said, you could do the sweetie pies. You know, the little sweethearts. Um, I have, of course, different versions. Because why not just try it all? You can mix and match. I just thought this was so cute. Kim does amazing projects. All If you did not go check out the whole group, which in my, if you go back to my New Year's Eve tutorial or video, I listed all the designers in a row. So just remember, look at the project. It doesn't always have to be what they intended it for. It could be something totally different, but this is stinking cute. You know, you could just have fun with it. So just saying, you know, you guys just kind of play. I don't know. Um, I did try the Hershey Kisses. Those fit in there. I don't know if you could fit two. Oh, look at there. You could fit two Kit Kats and a box of the Sweethearts. But I just, it's so cute. What do you guys think? I can't wait to hear. If you did do... The New Year's Eve crop. What was your favorite one? Not that any of them are bad, but just, you know, all things resonate with us differently. So what was your favorite project? Go check out Kim's. I will link her video, um, her tutorial in this. Um, but again, just know on mine, I added a lip if you look at it and looks different, which is just another, the same size as this piece here, which I want to say is one inch by like eight and a quarter. I think it's one inch by eight and a quarter. And instead of wrapping the whole thing with chipboard, I just wrapped one side and then used the other side as a hinge. And for here, just again, another reminder, I didn't glue mine down. You can. Um, totally up to you. But I like the option of lifting this up and whatever's in here lifts up with it so you can easily grab it. But, oh my gosh, can I please tell you as I was making this, I was and I don't even really like Kit Kats, but I was wanting to eat it. Just because it was on my desk. And when I'm sitting at a desk, all I ever want to do is eat. That's just how it always is. I, I, I know. I got issues. I got issues. But there you guys go. First Valentine's project. Um, I'm going to be making some more things. I have some design team things I got to do. So I'm going to be a busy girl. But I really hope that you guys have been liking the non mini album projects um just as much as you know the mini albums sometimes it's just fun to have some cute little gifts but i'm just telling you this would be cute this could be a cute little pencil box holder um candy bars can go in there don't do that middle piece just leave it as an open box just a lot of cute things chapsticks i'm sure could fit in here cute 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 but thank you, Kim, and thank you guys for watching. Hop on over to her channel and take a look at that tutorial. It's adorable. Okay, talk to you guys later. Bye.